Are you unable to read unusual patterns? Are even bursts too long for you? Or are you just unable to count past two? Whatever the case, fear not, because I know exactly what you need to do. What's going on guys, it's me Sa here, and today I'm going to be your six digit certified farm expert. And instead of telling you some stupid lies about how you need to play more or diversify your skill set, instead I'm going to show you how you can make your own farm maps. Now you might ask yourself, why would I trust a guy who doesn't even have a single map ranked? And that is an excellent question. Now for step one, what you want to do is find a song you want to map. And luckily for you, most of the banger PP songs already have their own map sets, meaning you don't even have to time the BPM yourself. Now as you can see, I've chosen a TV size map, or how it's more commonly referred to by us pro players, a marathon map, because it's still way too long for what we want to do with it. Now, as mentioned in step one, the map is still way too long, which is why for step two we are going to cut it down to a more reasonable size. Now, as you can see in the official O's law, our maps need to be at least 30 seconds long. Luckily for us, this is the ideal amount of time to make our PP magic work. But be careful, don't just cut out all the easy parts, we're going to need some of those for later. So all you want to do is place a snip here and here. And look at that, we're already on our way to proceed to step 3. Now, since we've just copied the BPM, this is where the fun begins. So what we are going to do is separate the map into two different segments. Now, for this step, we are going to work with the first one, which is going to be the slow segment. But before we can fill it up, let me tell you something about sliders. They have a very nice property. You can basically just click them whenever and still get a 300. And trust me, we are going to need that. Because to assure that we are going to pass with good accuracy, we're going to need lots of them. So just place them here. It doesn't really matter, just try to somewhat follow the music and you're good. And now for the interesting part. Now, since the first part is pretty easy, it's not going to generate us a lot of PP, which is why the second part exists. Here, what we are going to do is just fill it up with 1-2 jumps, maybe throw in the occasional slider so it doesn't get too hard on our fingers, but that's basically it. As you can see, the map already gives some nice PP, but now, as a final step, we are going to increase that. You know how when cooking an egg, adding this tiny bit of salt at the end just makes everything pop. We are basically going to do the same thing here. But instead of salt, what we are going to sprinkle on is the only kind of background worthy of such a masterpiece. And now let's give it another go and see how we did. As you can see, the PP is increasing a lot more. Oh, whoa, wait, what's that? Someone's at the door. Be right back. FBI, open up! <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 